finally Georgie. Where it's called Exprad, how beautiful and amazing you are. Seeing you walking down the aisle always made me cry. And I've been dreaming about this moment for the last two years and I can finally call you my wife. The last seven years have been the best years of my life and I look forward to starting a new chapter as husband and wife and spending the rest of my life with you. But everyone knows me, always knows I want to go to Japan. This was made even more special when I got to go with you. You're the best person I've ever met and the fact that I proposed you and you said yes makes me the happiest man ever. That was the happiest day of my life until today. <laughs> until you, you walked down the aisle and I saw you as the most beautiful person I've ever seen. You're my best friend, my soulmate, the love of my life, my waifu. <laughs> <laughs> so I would love everyone to raise a grass to the beautiful bride. <laughs> <laughs> to Georgie. <laughs> In the presence of God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit, we have come together to witness the marriage of Callum and Georgina. Marriage is a gift of God in creation through which husband and wife may know the grace of God. It is given that as a man and a woman grow together in love and trust, they shall be united with one another in heart, body and mind. The gift of marriage brings husband and wife together in the delight and tenderness of sexual union and joyful commitment to the end of their lives. Callum and Georgina are now to enter fully into this way of life. They will each give their consent to the other and make solemn vows. I, Callum, take you, Georgina, to be my wife. I, Georgina, take you, Callum, to be my husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. Until death us do part. According to God's holy love. In the presence of God, I make this vow. Georgie, I give you this ring. Cal, I give you this ring. As a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God. Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Callum and Georgina have given their consent, made their marriage vows to each other, declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. How you may stand and kiss your bride. So may God, the Holy Trinity, make you strong in faith and hope and love, defend you on every side and guide you in truth and peace. May the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. My lords, ladies and gentlemen. No, I think that's the wrong note. <laughs> it's George and Cal's wedding day. And the warmest of welcomes from me, George's dad, to you, our two families and friends, who are all playing your part on this wonderful occasion. Words to describe this unique couple. Lovable, admirable, and sincerely, I don't think they have a selfish, hard-hearted, or unkind bone in their body. May your joys be as bright as a sunny morning, and your sorrows only shadows that fade away in the light of your love. 
And finally, ladies and gentlemen, please stand up and raise your glasses and drink with me a toast to George and Callum, Mr. and Mrs. Chidotto. To George and Cal. Callum, we feel for a lot growing up, largely underpinned by playing Lord of the Rings, Battle for Middle Earth, and Gears of War well into the night. We've had great memories from our nights out at the Crazy House and Shakedown and over the years you've been a wonderful and loving friend. Georgie, I'm so happy that you bring Callum happiness, laughter and joy. I wholeheartedly believe you and Callum are perfect for each other. We're all here today to celebrate Callum and George's perfect day and I just want to say a massive congratulations and I hope it's been special so far and continues to be throughout the day. Please can everyone join me by raising your glasses to the newlyweds. Yeah.